I use this 2x2 two two no more. We have Gan now. I love me some Gan cubes. Alright. First we've got an adjustment tool. I don't know how to use this, so I'm just going to put it there. And now we have an instruction manual. I don't know if this is... This is for 2x2. Two two. I'll look at that later. The, the main attraction of the day is the actual cube. I don't think there are any, like, bags or accessories. I'm not 100% sure. Oh, I just took the cube out of its basket. Yeah. Okay. Ugh. Ugh. Just don't twist on two by twos. Oh, never mind. They do. Because uh, this, this is the only corner that you can't take off when you like disassemble a two by two. Oh wow, that is. Wait. I can't really turn it fast because of the way I'm holding it next to the camera. Okay, we've got front POV. I just, do, I, I don't do two by two. I just, I don't do two by two. I don't really, I mainly only do three by three. This is a broken three by three, hold up. I mainly only do three by three. So, well, I, but I'm going to a competition, so, and I used to use this, like, chi to I do, or whatever, or however you pronounce it. And that kept happening. This one piece kept sliding off, and it literally, like, fell onto my chair right now, so I needed a new 2 by 2 And I just got it this year, like, on June 9th, and it's, I only got it, like, a month ago. But, yeah, I, I kind of like this question is is there anything else in the box no it's just styrofoam all right um where'd the instruction manual go i'm not sure where it went but here's the little adjustment tool we need how do you use this it doesn't work like that can i like take a piece off i don't think so but yeah i really like this can i speed solve it though I do 2x2 two two in a really weird way, because I learned 3x3 three three first, and then I, like, I first tried 2x2, two two, and then I learned 3x3, three three, so, so, um, now I solve 2x2 two two like a 3x3, three three. so first I do the white side, then I do the yellow side, and then I do this special alg. That solves it. But it's much easier to solve because a lot of times I can like... So, let me actually just walk you guys through it. So first, I solve the white side. Sometimes I use like... Sometimes I, use, I, I do different things. My keyboard is right in my way. So then I have to like line up all of these pieces like this i have to line them all up like that i sh and like it's the same as when i um uh i i'm doing a cross right now It's the same as when I like, um, when you're doing, uh, what's it called? When you're doing three by three and you need to like line up, line everything up in a way so that it's like plus signs or whatever, like T's. Just ignore all of these other pieces and it's like T's. I need to, I do that on two by two, but just without the last part. I don't know why I do two by two like this. And then I just flip it over and I solve the yellow side with one repeated algorithm. And sometimes I do another one. And then I just do this special algorithm that I found. 
that just vanishes off the cube. Let's read the manual while my computer starts the um the stopwatch so I can speed so. Um oh. Hope you can read Chinese. Oh, and it's all Chinese. Thanks, Gan. That all kind of my way. So This cube is very loud. It's kind of like it's kind of like the GAN 11. I This is the GAN 11. I made a video looking at it, but I just forgot to upload it. All right. WC8, two by two by two. We are going to be speed solving. Two by two, okay, yeah. First, let's get the cube all scrambled up. All right. All right, I don't have a stack mat. My stack mat is coming on the 12th, but we're gonna use CS stack. Um, okay, we're gonna start, wait. Um, oh, okay. Three, two, one, go. This is the part that takes up most of the time of the um, two by two, the aligning the um, second layer or the solving the first layer. But yeah, that's a, that's a really bad time. I don't do two by two. I I mainly focus on three by three. I mainly focus three by three. Twenty three point four nine. Um. Okay. That was a lucky first layer. If that, if that part wasn't too lucky. Oh, the OL skip. Uh, um, was it OL skip? It's kind of PL. It's PLL skip for the um two by two. I need a tissue. Ah. Okay. Um, that's the that's time for today. Um, I, I'm going to need to, oops, bad with cameras. I'm going to need to, like, try to break this in a lot. But, what's the main question? Can you solve a 2 by 2 by only twisting the corners? No, it's impossible. Speaking of impossible, can you get impossible cases on 2 by 2 I'm, I'm one, I'm one piece from... You guys can't see it because I'm just. That's a new. That's a new best. That's another new best. Seventeen point zero zero. Oh, that's a new actual best on two by two. My old best was nineteen point zero nine. I just broke my record two times in a row without without noticing it because of because of Gan. All because of Gan. This cube is definitely gonna need some breaking in. Yeah, it's going to need some breaking in, probably. But, yeah. Basically, I only needed to get this because this 2x2 two two kept popping. Yeah, this two, the, my old 2x2 two two kept popping. Are they the same size? They are. My old 2x2 two two kept popping, so I needed a new one. Um, you guys may have seen my video, um, what's it called again? What was it called? Um, it was called POV, um, you get a corner twist on 2 by 2 because I had a corner twist that I couldn't twist back. Um, because these corners are impossible to twist. So, uh, on this cube. So, um, no. My solution was peeling off the stickers and putting them back. But now I have a stickerless 2x2. Two two. 
where I can um, twist corners. Yay. And it's a gang. Gang isn't... Yeah, well, I, I don't think I would... I don't really know. I still have, like, mixed thoughts about the... About the GAN... What is the model? This is why I hate this cube. Um, what is this model? GAN 249V2. I also just threw that piece across the room. Um... Yes, this is the Gan, the GAN 249 version 2. So, I don't know what the version 1 was like, but... Yeah, this cube is... I don't really know what to think about it yet. It's kind of like in the middle of good and bad. I did make a video about the GAN 11M Pro. I just forgot to upload it, so I'm just going to make it again. Um. Um... Yeah, I, I need to open this box. I don't think there's anything in here, though. It also came with this cool box thingy that when you open... Oh, nope, that's the wrong cube. It goes in there. There's my first cube. I liked making those. Um. Okay, so that's the box. It also came with this, like, thingy of accessories or, like, adjustment tools. So, it came with this, like, screwdriver. No, I wonder if this one is magnetic. Oh. It feels weird because it's not magnetic. I thought it was magnetic. No, this this cube ain't magnetic. I've been scammed. Um, That's why it felt so weird. I couldn't feel the magnetic force of the magnets. So, there's this screwdriver to adjust these little can can my camera focus to adjust these so there's the screwdriver to adjust the force of the magnets to adjust the force of these magnets so i would recommend putting them on three i was just playing around with them and they ended up on two so that's the that's the adjustment thingy. It also came with all of these um these little nuts. Hold on. Let me tape off the cap. It came with these little nuts on it. Um and this adjustment tool that oops that it makes it easier to make the cube looser or tighter. I was just making sure that I didn't put it so loose that I was gonna pop. Um, so yeah, that is all of all the stuff that came with it. Also, of course, it did come with an instruction manual, but this instruction manual is incredibly big and it's in Chinese. Oh wait, no, it's in English too, but I don't want to read right now. But let's do an example solve. Yeah. I've changed it to three by three. And now let's see what we've got. Um, okay. Three. Oops. Okay. I'm not the fastest three by three cuber, especially when I have an, uh, a recording thingy right in front of me and I can't see anything. Uh, where's the red blue piece? You guys can't see much, and I just messed up the cross. You guys can't see much, because I'm just trying to turn fast. Um, there's an F2L pair. That, um, that what's a cold really sent me back. Oh, um, 
one, two, one, 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 two, one, 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 two. All right. Oh, oh, I forgot to stop the timer. Um, a minute, 18, 89. All right. Yeah, I'm not that fast at three by three, but that's three by three and that's two by two. I also recently got this Molusk cube so that I could compete with it at my competition that's coming up on the 13th. So my stack mat is going to get here um, the day before my competition. So I'll be able to use it in practice. Um, yeah, I got this Moe skew because they're going to do skew at the competition. And I have no clue how to solve a skew. I, I don't like how it turns either. It's like really slippery. The other day I was like, I like dropped it and it like turned and it like scrambled the whole cube. So this is a Moe's cube. I was going to read the instructions, but guess what? They're in Chinese, so I can't. Um, let's actually try to check out its insides. That sounded weird. It's getting kind of, I, I don't think I can tear it apart. Scube, so that's all I really have to say about this new scube. Um, it's a Moe scube, that's all I have to say. The main center of attraction today was the brand new 2x2. But that's all I have for today, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs> now it's just a core.